good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle the bayern fans singing their songs this indeed is a super club in so many ways Plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. That gets things running. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Well, Witzel is an interesting character. He won't back down from a challenge thanks to his, his combative nature. And he's happy to give it to the more capable attacking talent. And he tries a shot! Just off target. Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. Davis plays it into the box. Goretzka. He's gone for it! Witzel. Guerrero. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. It's got through to him. It has got through to has a pop! And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again. A 1-0 lead established. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering and, listen, we all expect that. Witzel. Royce. Plays it out to the wing. Real chance! Oh, it just wouldn't sit for him. Uh, that's unlucky. The idea was really smart for me and, and he's had a good go at it. Kimmich. Out to the left it goes. Has a goal! Davis. Sancho goes looking. Gets away from his opponent. It's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. 
Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. Sancho. Coman. Muller. Cleared without complication. Sancho. Alaba with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Dortmund just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. Cut out in the nick of time. There's the whistle for half-time. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. To review the first half. Peter, this is far from a lost cause. Yes, they've been hit once by a, a pacey opposition, but they've asserted more control and, and look capable. Bayern Munich head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. The action has already resumed here. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Nicely controlled. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Sancho never really looked sure of what he was doing, and by holding on... Oh, shooting chance! That has skinned the post. Oh, and it's such a good effort, and maybe the target really should have been hit. So here comes the substitution. Chan. Just an hour gone. Your impression so far, Jim? I think the manager's pondering his options as to whether to stick or twist. Well, that's a foul. Which side of the line is that? Well, the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Well. It was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. That's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. It's a promising run he's making on the right. And it's Goretzka. Aliso, Lewandowski, Lewandowski gets flagged offside. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Witzel. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1 0. Well, 
This is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Uh, hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they paid the price and deserved it. another change here well he's worked so hard for his side uh, as you would expect but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise Bayern Munich take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in Witzel Witzel has given away a free kick Sancho absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Keeper sends it forward. Decent looking ball. He's had a Lewandowski! Great effort, beautifully taken. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. It's on a plate. It could be. He's had a shot. They are rampant. And the lead is extended still further. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. And that will be the final act. A great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. How do you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Of course, we all love to watch the creative side of the game and goal scorers, but there's an art to good defence too, and their organisation and discipline has helped earn this win. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening. <laughs>